are four types of Akita Inu colors identified by the Japan Kennel Club, Red Fawn, Brindle, White, and Sesame. Red Fawn is the most popular color and Sesame is the rarest. And in today's video, I'll show you accurately and extremely specific about the acceptable Akita Inu colors coat. Let's dive right in. Akita Coat Types The standard coat of Akita dogs is short hair. They have a double coat with a soft, dense undercoat and a short top coat. However, the Waseo dog, which is very famous and influential in the media, has long and swollen hair. This is a long-haired breed of mutant Akita Inu dog called Muku hair, but they are rarely distributed to the general public. What colors do Akita come in? Akita Inu colors are various which include red fawn, brindle, white, and sesame. The Kennel Club in England outlines that all types of Akita Inu colors should have Urajiro markings except white dogs. According to the Japanese standard for the Akita used by the FCI, Urajiro is whitish coat on the sides of the muzzle, on the cheeks, on the underside of the jaw, and the neck, on the chest, stomach, the underside of the tail, and on the inside of the legs. The Urajiro markings must mix with the main coat color gradually. The American Kennel Club states that Urajiro markings could be less visible on Brindle Akita Inu, where they can be a gray frosted overlay of the main coat color. Akita Inu Colors Red Fawn Red Fawn is the most common color of Akita Inu. Red Fawn dogs have a reddish brown color around the forehead, back, and limbs. Many people think of Red Fawn color when they think about Japanese Akita dogs. The Akita in the film Hachi, a dog's tail has also a red fawn coat. The color varies from pale beige to almost fiery red. At one time, white hair grows on the inside of the ears, cheeks, bottom of the muzzle, chest, abdomen, and inner part of the limbs. Also, in the process of becoming an adult dog from a puppy, the red fawn part often becomes thinner, and the ratio of red fawn and white often changes. Akita Inu Colors Brindle Brindle Akitas are dogs that have tiger patterns on their body. Brindle color, very unique and inimitable. It's impossible to meet two identical brindle coats. In addition, the color looks different in natural light, artificial, in the morning, afternoon, and evening. Brindle coat is divided into three types, red tiger hair, black tiger hair, and marble. Red tiger hair refers to a coat based on red, and has a black tiger pattern. Black tiger hair refers to a coat based on black, and has a whitish or brown tiger pattern. Marble Tiger refers to a coat based on grayish-white, and has a black tiger pattern. Like Red Fawn Akitas, these Brindle dogs also have white hair on the underside and inside their body. Brindle Akita has a powerful appearance and attracts many dog lovers. Akita Inu colors white. The white Akita Inu dogs are covered with white hair all over their body. The main feature of these dogs is the absence of even small marks and spots in the body. Daily care is essential to maintain their White Akita Inus are not albinos, since they have pigment. Albinism is the condition in which dogs lack pigment. Since the pigment is light congenitally, the color of their nose tends to fade. Most White Akita Inu puppies were born with black noses, but their nose often has a red bean, light brown, color when they become adult dogs. Even if white-haired Akita has a pink nose, it's still not the fault of the breed. According to the observation of many owners, White Akitas are more prone to allergic reactions. One of the manifestations of allergies is the yellow spots that appear on the ears, muzzle, and back. Akita Inu Colors Sesame Sesame Akita's coat is a mixture of red, black, and white. This color is not popular like others. The base of the sesame is red with black tips on the back, the white bottom. Tipping is usually light, even on the head and body. The white color is important. It appears in their cheeks, lower jaw, chest, stomach, inner parts of limbs, and tail. Nowadays, you can barely see a sesame coat. Do Akitas change colors? An Akita Inu's coat can be different during younger years compared to their older years. The Akita Inu colors are formed with age. In addition, sunshine, nutritional state, skin disease, and medications can all cause an Akita's coat color to change. Is coat color linked to health issues? Every dog is prone to develop genetic health problems, particularly dogs that already have genetic mutations. But it doesn't mean that your Akita Inu will definitely suffer from some health illnesses. You should ensure that you have a healthy dog bought from a reputable breeder. We've just walked through four standard Akita Inu colors according to the Japan Kennel Club that includes Red Fawn, Brindle, White, and Sesame. Now I'd like to hear from you. What is your favorite Akita Inu color? 
Let me know by leaving a comment below right now. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and check the description box.